Often when people think of CRM, they don't consider customer relationship management encompasses sales, marketing, and customer service. Many people just think about sales management. But once a sale is complete, you have a new customer. And a key part of relationship management is post-sale. Thus, we have Sugar Serve. Today we will explore and focus on what happens when a client has a post-sale question, issue, or problem that needs our attention and resolution. Good customer service builds satisfaction and fosters retention, which is important to revenue, cross-selling, and advocacy. Before diving right in, let's have a quick review on what is SugarServe today, or areas of focus within this SugarServe application. Case management enables us to manage customer issues through the resolution process, a closed loop. This is enabled by workforce management and customer self-service for them to express their own issues at their own time. We use omni-channel components such as phone, chat, and email as portal to give customers access to multiple ways of communicating their issue with the organization. Knowledge base supports how we find and resolve issues in a standard manner, and after the results are in, we have analytics to look at what kind of problems are we having? Is there a trend? And how can we solve problems more quickly? All of this is supported through our communication channels and business process management templates that ensure a closed loop process. So thinking about how sugar goes to market, we seek to remove blind spots in an organization and serve enables that by giving customers the omni-channel access into multiple ways to express their issues to us. Internally, the user has dashboards and drawers so that they can experience the most amount of data with the least amount of navigation to get the job done. And it's available just about anywhere, in their browser, on their phone, and in their inbox. All of this reduces the busy work of an individual agent and the entire organization. Workflows and routing rules and notifications ensure people stay on task and on point. A knowledge base simplifies finding resolutions. And Sugar Live enables us to chat live or have a conversation with people with a screen pop to the right record. This all removes roadblocks for us. Sometimes a salesperson is the first person to find out about an issue. People create cases right from their inbox, whether they're in sales or service. And Sugar Live again supports the capture of voice and chat conversations and can even produce sentiment analysis. So if we look at a typical situation where a person calls in, they are, can be routed through the phone system to the right person in the right department. Once that person receives the phone call, the screen will pop and get the information in front of them so they can serve the customer on the other end of the line. All of this results in a call being logged, a case being created, and the customer problem solved. Let's have a look and see what it looks like. Often a customer's first reaction to solving a problem is going to their inbox and composing an email. When an email is received by somebody in the organization, they can see that the customer is expressing a problem and have shown us what the issue is. Sugar Connect enables us to view that customer record automatically and we can even go down and see cases within the system and try to determine whether that case has already been expressed to other people and in this instance it has. If it hadn't, we could go here to create a new case, but we can also quickly drill down and realize that there is an existing case the customer has already created through another channel. I could quickly write a reply and let them know that we're already on it and working on the resolution and that we'll get back to them shortly. This builds the confidence that the customer is being served. Once in CRM, this user is logged in as a service manager. They can look at the types of problems that are being expressed the type of workload that goes across the team, and can also view quickly the fact that a new case has come in that's been expressed by a customer. By drilling down onto the item, we can quickly get into the case itself and see, again, the notes that came through from the email. We can scroll down and see that a phone call actually had been had come through, and by clicking on that, we can pull out a drawer and quickly access the details about the previously made call that came in from the customer. Back in the dashboard, I'm going to now take a look at the caseload. By drilling down onto the Cases tab, I can look up and down the list here, and by tapping down on any of these individual cases, I can pull out details in the drawer. This helps me determine 
What's going on with this case? Are there any open tasks within myself or my team? And who is it that we need to get in contact with? By drilling down the list, I can also take a look at some of the other cases. And by leaving the drawer open, I can quickly experience more information with very little navigation. So I can determine which is the right case for me to dial into. And from here, I can quickly drill through into an individual case. While I'm doing a little research here, let's take a look at what's going on on the customer side. In the customer portal, the customer can log in and they have access to knowledge base articles that we've published out for them to use and experience as part of their troubleshooting. We can also look through the fact that they have other things, including that broken box they previously recommended we needed resolution for. They can go in and add a note to let us know what's going on inside the box. The customer can even browse to attach a photo of the damaged box. Customers also have the ability to interact with us live. By clicking down here in the corner, they can enable live chat. Internally, I'm getting a notification that a new conversation has begun. By clicking accept, it starts the chat session and automatically navigates me to the appropriate record based on who has started the chat session with me back in the portal. I can continue my chat session. I can also navigate the system and see open cases. I can see recent submittals of information, including the damaged box that was just attached through the portal. This helps me have no blind spots and cuts down on the busy work I need to do by the navigation automatically sorting the record to the right contact and even showing me the case with the recent note that's been added. This certainly saves me a lot of time and enables me to serve customers faster and more simply. Today you have experienced some examples of how we let the platform do the work to enable users to work with great efficiency and to ensure that we are managing customer issues from awareness through resolution. Additionally, the platform does the work in the background with automated processes. Here is an example of process escalation tied to cases, another way of eliminating busy work. In instances where personnel is required, we have field service automation, turning cases into billable work. Service employees can be matched with skills and geofenced based on their service availability and territory. And the platform will offer the resources with the right geo, the right skills, and availability for each assignment. Once on site, mobile allows them to find the job, complete the job, record notes, take pictures, and record time. Now you can see how SugarServe is a critical part of the HDCX story. High definition customer experience. SugarServe completes an important part of the CX or customer experience journey. And our tools are designed to eliminate blind spots, busy work, and roadblocks. Thank you for joining us today and learning more about SugarServe.